Hey guys, welcome to a simulation Sunday. So, um, while it's loading, I'm going to take a second to talk about what it is. It's a forest fire simulation. So there's a wind speed variable and a spread speed variable. So wind speed controls how far it can jump. Spread speed controls something else. It's not entirely accurate yet, but I'm working on that. Okay, it just loaded in. There's a lot of lag because of how many trees there are. Oh, here it goes. Okay, the lag has stopped, mostly. So now you can see the fire is spreading. The fire in that area already went out. It's not super good, and the outlines of the trees do look pretty weird. Next week, I'm going to add a wind direction variable, so that will kind of control the angle at which it can spread. So here you see the fire kind of spreads, and then it dies out. And I know not all the fire particles are burning trees or, ever, or anything, and if you're wondering why certain trees up high are getting burned, that's because the fire is touching their trunks, and then they burn, too. And this is going to take a while. Anyway, so, yeah, that was today's Simulation Sunday. Prepare for next week with... I plan on adding firefighters and winds, maybe some better trees and also a wind direction variable. But at the moment, the fire burns, it spreads, then it dies because it's wasted all its fuel. But as you can see, it's still growing even though they are dying. So that's a pretty big forest fire right there. It's kind of mesmerizing to watch, actually. But anyway, that's it for today. Hope you enjoyed that simulation Sunday. Like and comment below for what you'd like to see me do next week if you want to see me keep working on this or start something new. Either way, I'm fine with that. And I will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.